When you shop for groceries, you hope to buy foods that can keep you healthy. So it's kind of ironic that the store where you're shopping is crawling with germs that could make you ill. How to keep your supermarket from making you sick is on the top of the list. The bright lights of the supermarket seem to shine on every nook and cranny, but germs are masters at hide and go seek. So to keep secret germs out of your grocery bag, start by getting a handle on the shopping cart. Uh, keep in mind that different foods, um, especially meats that have juices or fish that have juices, can leak out on that cart. Many supermarkets now have those wipes when you walk in so that you can wipe down um, the handle of your shopping cart. Next, the deli could be a slice of germ heaven. In a supermarket environment, especially in the deli, that's one of the worst places uh, to try to keep clean. Are they wearing gloves, number one? Are they changing their gloves between each order? Is the slicing machine clean or does it have little scraps um, from, from what was previously cut? That scale can also have cross-contamination from different meats or different cheeses. They should have a fresh piece of wax paper or paper on that scale before they put that product on top of it. Bacteria breeds in that kind of environment. So if you don't see gloves, a clean slicer, or wax paper on the scale, make sure to ask for them. Finally, germs can also breed in produce. Next time that you're in the store, take a look at the mister itself. Very often, those are never clean. And what you find is you really see calcium deposits or other dirt forming on that nozzle head. So what you want to do is make sure if your supermarket does have a mister that you're digging down, that you're not getting the produce that's right on the top that's getting that cross-contamination from the mister. Those are the dirtiest places. Now find out one of the germiest foods at thelisttv.com. Germ-free is the way to be on the top of our list.